Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you are new here. If you guys are new, hi, my name's Natalie. And today's Saturday. I'm just gonna do a day in my life vlog. It's August 26th and it's 1.18 right now in the afternoon. I literally didn't do anything this morning. I slept in and then I went to the pool for like an hour and a half and I just walked back in the apartment. I seriously hate that my body gets way tanner than my face because it just I want my face to get tan and it just only tans a tiny bit but whatever like I I'm not gonna sit here and fry my skin just for my face to get tan but anyways um I feel like I have a lot to talk about but I'm gonna try and do it kind of quickly and make it as fast and simple as I can um, I did get a new phone recently. Uh, I'm super happy about that. So my mom and my brother and I went to, we originally had AT&T and T-Mobile was doing like a deal. Um, so we basically traded in my phone and my brother's phone for free for a iPhone 14. And then my mom got a new Samsung Ultra something. Can't remember what it was. So all three of us got new phones and then it also brought her I also brought the phone bill down um, a little bit cheaper. So I got a new phone, so excited because my iPhone 11, it was just, I just needed a new phone. Anyways, um, I switched out the rental. So I was supposed to pick up my car uh, on Wednesday. I got a call, they said my car was ready and then I went to go pick it up and basically there's something that I want them to fix on the car before I bought it. So on the front of the bumper, the left headlight and the bumper is not completely flush. And I just want them to fix that. That was part of the deal for um, me to buy the car. Like I basically pointed out everything I saw wrong with the car, which they're really, I mean, it's like a brand new car. There, there really wasn't much wrong with it. There was just small things like, for example, um there was a few areas i wanted them to buff out and then like two areas i wanted them to like repaint so there was just small little scratches and then the director was like yes like we can do that and then i saw like the flush of like the bumper and the headlight just wasn't completely flush and he said we can fix that for you pop it into place whatever it, it needs you know we can fix it i was like okay cool like i want the car anyways so they basically had to take my car to the body shop because apparently a little clip is missing in the front headlight and the bumper so they have to replace the whole bumper which it's fine because i'm not paying for it so i want everything to get done on my new car before i like before just anything happens in the long run so i will not be having my new <laughs> acura ilx back for a couple weeks i only drove it for two weeks and then they started doing all the buffing and the paint and stuff and then now they're doing the bumper so i switched out the acura rdx rental that they gave me which was super nice and i asked for a smaller car and so they gave me the um, acura integra which was the first car i actually test drove and really wanted to buy but it was just way too it was not in my budget at all um so yeah i'm test i'm uh, they gave me the rental, they gave me an Integra to drive, which is really fun. <laughs> but anyways, I just made a fresh cup of um, espresso and I added a couple pumps of salted caramel to it. I have been on a stricter um, diet, I guess you could say, recently, the past couple weeks. I've been trying to cut down. I feel like there's, I think I either just built too much muscle too fast or i don't know um like i just want to cut down a little bit lose some lose a little fat and like tone up and lean up so i've been making protein coffee for the past couple of weeks and today i just wanted a regular oat milk iced latte it's saturday and i just i just wanted a regular cup of coffee i had my protein this morning i just had a snack um so i can easily get right now i'm getting in about 120 to 130 grams of protein um and so yeah but anyways making a cup of coffee chris is on his way back he went to the dentist today and so i want to add my chobani oat milk i have not had this oat milk in literally like four weeks and it's crazy because i can't believe i went that long without 
So I did just like the serving size, probably about a cup. I've kind of been, at first I started measuring a lot and now I'm kind of like eyeballing things. I really still, I need to get a scale so I can start weighing everything. But I normally just use like my cups and like my measuring spoons and stuff. But now I just need to add ice. regular cup of coffee in so long it's always like protein 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 anyways i'm about to prep some chicken in the crock pot i'm gonna make some taco chicken i got my chicken breast pretty much thawed out completely right now and i'm gonna throw them in the crock pot and for seasonings i'm just using this um mccormick taco seasoning and i always get the less sodium ones just because I try and keep my sodium down especially with like weight loss and stuff. I wouldn't say that I'm like trying to lose a shit ton of weight, but I'm just trying to lean up basically. Alright, I just added the chicken breast into the crock pot. I added one packet of the taco seasoning, one can of diced tomatoes, and some black pepper, and about a fourth about a fourth cup of chicken broth. I normally um, use the crock pot, especially when we go to work since we're gone all day. And I normally set it to eight hours, but today I think I'm just going to do six hours on high and then see where that goes. But it smells really good. So the last time I spoke to you guys in my last vlog, I was talking about the BEC exam that I was scheduled to take last week. And I went in, took my exam. I got my score back. Um, I did not pass. Shocking, because I thought I did really well. Actually, I thought I did decent enough to pass. Um, so yeah, that's disappointing. But I'm going to honestly just retest here within like the next couple weeks if there's an opening from when i looked on prometric the only opening um in dallas was like october 30th and then the rest was like november and december specifically for dallas but there are other locations like for example tyler texas had some openings in september for bec exam and I don't know if I'm gonna drive to go take an exam, but like, can I help you? Why are you looking at me? I guess you're staring at me while I'm vlogging. Uh, Do you wanna come talk to them? She needs y'all's support to go to CPA class on weekends and go to necessary locations to take the exams where she needs to. I've tried. She doesn't listen to me. Ever. I'm just gonna drink my coffee. Ever. So, y'all. Okay, question. If you guys had to drive an hour and to two hours for else, an exam elsewhere for, for a, a CP for, for a professional for, for, exam for a CPA exam would you guys do it yes like, comment down below if yes you, if you would yes I'm generally curious yes <laughs> we're debating right now personally oh, I just don't it. know if I can like mentally drive for two hours and then mentally sit down and take a four you hour exam the dear lord anyways so Pretty much if I want to take, if I want to retest for the exam in a few weeks, I have to like drive to another city to go take it because as of now, there are no openings in Dallas to take the exam. So yeah, um, I have PTO this coming up week. So I'm taking off a whole week and then the following Monday is Labor Day. So I'm pretty much taking off like over a week. But anyways, and then I'll go back to 
a four day work week and then I'll be at the client for the next two weeks after that. So yeah, she's got 13 days of PTO. Yeah, it's actually really nice. Um, so yeah, what else? I feel like, I think that's all the updates I kind of wanted to talk to you guys about. Um, I'm about to do the dishes. Um, yeah, honestly, that's pretty much it, I think. Oh, we got an air fryer from Target. So, just trying to learn how to use that, but it's just the Ninja. You, act, you, guys, you guys are actually, I'm using it as my camera stand right now, but got the Ninja. Um, so far, we've used it a couple times, and so far we like it. We're just still learning how to like use it and how much to cook certain things in it. Um, <clears throat> but yeah, we're gonna. I'm gonna do. We're gonna do the dishes. <laughs> going on so it's super loud right now but I got my new protein powder in about two days ago and it's the devotion angel food cake I've just been seeing it all over TikTok and the protein powder I've been using for a while <coughs> I just like inhaled all the powder anyway <coughs> bro it's like when you first open it and then all that powder like shoots up but anyways um, the organic protein I was using, it's good. It just has like a really chalky like aftertaste. Like you, it, you can tell like it's protein powder. This one does not. I've had it in my coffee. I've had it, I made protein waffles and then I had it in like regular milk just to like try it. It's really good. It's the Devotion Angel Food Cake. And I also want to try the other flavors. There's a brownie brittle and then there's a cinnamon flavor. I really want to try those as well. All right, we just got back from Costco. I put gas in the uh, rental, and then we literally just got a few things. Mainly, we mainly went there to exchange the lemons that we got last weekend because they were not good. So I'm currently washing the bag of lemons that we got. We got some Ziploc bags, some paper plates. Um, what else did we get? I think that was it. And then Chris picked up his prescription. Oh, we also got some Aleve. And then he got prescription. He got like mouthwash prescription, but because he went to the dentist today. And the crockpot chicken is still cooking. It smells so yummy. Ooh, fogged up the screen. It smells so good. It smells like tacos. Hi, Bubba. Do you want to say hi to everyone? 
You want to say hi? You want to say hi in so long? Say hi in so long. Hi. With you, with you, I feel so lucky I met you and I still can't believe that I get to see those eyes from more than tonight. I swear you must have felt from the sky and I feel Good morning guys, it's Sunday. I did not finish the vlog yesterday. I figured I'd just carry it over to today. Um, Chris is out running some errands. He went to the pet store to exchange some wet food that Jasper doesn't like. And then he um, he's on his way back. So I just made breakfast for the both of us. Um, smells so good. I'm hungry. <laughs> yesterday, so we ran all those errands yesterday and then I took a shower and just put on Netflix and then fell asleep. And the toast is burning. That's nice. Love that. Chris a cup of coffee. Mine is chilling in the freezer. I'm gonna add protein to mine. Okay, here's your brown sugar shaken espresso. Duncan! You're welcome. Duncan? Being stinky in German. Oh. I thought you meant Dunkin' Donuts. I was like, okay. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna make my coffee now. It's been chilling in the freezer for a little over an hour. I'm, we're both in the den and Chris is playing video games and then I have like Netflix on the other screen So I'm like watching him play and then watching a movie at the same time Sorry if it's loud the washer is going um, Before the protein powder I was doing the premier protein caramel and vanilla in my coffee and I still have some left but Today I want to do the angel food cake. I got my Chobani oat milk. I think I did too much protein powder because at first I did half a scoop and I think a full scoop is too much. It smells really good and it's like super thick, so it's like a cold foam.
so i've literally been laying in bed like all day long watching netflix i think the last time i talked to you guys was when i was making lunch i just had some leftover rock pot chicken um taco chicken from last night and i just made like two tacos with that and then i watched a movie while chris was playing on his um, game he was playing world of warcraft and so he had like netflix on one screen so i was like literally sitting next to him in a chair with like a little blanket drinking my iced coffee and then he was playing his game on the other screen and then after that i came to the room and i have my little salt lamp on <laughs> you can barely see it but i've been watching netflix literally like all day we have uh Sn um, not snow white and the huntsman it's like the pre the pre-sequel it's called what happened we are watching the huntsman winter's war which is a pre-sequel of the snow white and the huntsman we're like halfway through it which is finished eating dinner um, I had a glass of red wine and I cannot remember the last time I had like I don't ever really drink alcohol I'm not a really big drinker but um, I drink occasionally and then also like trying to you know cut and watch what I'm eating and like putting in my body I haven't had alcohol in like weeks like a few weeks um I did have a vodka soda on Friday um, me and a co-worker went to uh happy hour and i had a drink but like vodka soda really isn't that bad so i try and kind of be a little loose on the weekend but still try and hit like my goals if that makes sense so like i try and not be so hard on myself on the weekend because i am human i crave certain things and um if i don't give myself that thing i will literally like binge eat it when i can if that makes sense but I try and let loose a little bit on the weekend um like yesterday i had pizza um real quick i want to show you this painting or not painting it's a it's a artwork that i got from home goods and i think it's super pretty it's just really cool so chris just hung it up today but it's black and gold and it has all the continents and whatnot on it and then it also has like glitter so from certain angles you can see it like shimmer um but it has really cool like there's a whale there's a little sea turtle you have your boat um and then the rest of the continents on there and then like the oceans and i just thought thought that was super cool um so yeah he just hung it up today also <laughs> he picked up a tv today <laughs> From home, from uh, Costco. And why did we need a new TV? I don't, yeah, I don't know. You, well, because we're hosting a draft party for fantasy football here. But that's anyways, right. so that's going to go here. We originally, we sold this one at a garage sale because it just was super old. Um, but I wanted to show you guys, my diplomas are up on the wall now. So here's my bachelor's of science. And then there is my master's of science diplomas and yeah so they're finally up on the wall and they, Thank look, you, chris. they look good yeah chris hung them up for me and then his is over there uh, you have your you have your bachelor's and your master's you should probably flip those the other way but that's okay no master's left i mean technically the master's supposed to be on top of those i mean yeah like yeah that's yeah probably. hi bubba's do you eat your foods? But anyways, I'm literally not doing anything the rest of the night. So I'm going to end the vlog here because I've just been super lazy today. Um, I'm on PTO this week as well. So I got to figure out what I'm going to do with myself for like eight days, nine days. Um, definitely probably study some even though i have no idea what to study because i don't really know what i got wrong on the cpa exam but i'm gonna try and study honestly just take it easy give myself some rest like this week is just kind of like 
focusing on me kind of like just getting rest and you know taking a chill to like taking it easy but anyways i hope you guys enjoyed the vlog um thank you for watching subscribe give the video a thumbs up and i'll see you guys in my next video bye